Do you know what to do when someone ignores you? Feeling ignored by someone we care about can feel painful and confusing. You may feel hurt, frustrated or even rejected especially if you don't know why it's happening. But what if I told you that you could flip the situation and use it to your advantage? According to relationship experts, there are eight proven steps to deal with being ignored. If you watch the video and follow these eight steps in the given order, you will learn exactly what to do when someone ignores you and you will never feel rejected again. Step 1. Are you sure that person is ignoring you? The first step when someone ignores you is to ask yourself this simple question. Are you sure that person is ignoring you? It might sound like a silly question, but it's important to check in with yourself first. There are times when we think someone is ignoring us when they are not actually. We might be feeling insecure or anxious and projecting those feelings onto the other person. Other times we might be misreading the situation entirely. You have to keep in mind that every person is different. Just because you feel ignored at some point doesn't mean the other person is actually ignoring you on purpose. Some people need more time and space than others to process what's going on around them. They might be going through something tough and need time to themselves. That's why it's important to check in with yourself first before assuming that someone is ignoring you. Step 2. Give them the space they need. If you're sure that person is ignoring you, then the next step is to give them space. This might be hard to do, especially if you care about the person a lot. But it's important to respect their needs and give them the space they need. We can't emphasize this step enough. Many people make the mistake of thinking that if they keep pushing, the other person will come around. But this behavior usually has the opposite effect. This will push them away even more. When you give someone space, it shows that you respect their needs and boundaries. It also gives them time to miss you. And in some cases, it might even make them realize how much they care about you. And this alone can make them come back to you on their own. For example, if you are used to texting or calling them every day, make sure to take a step back. Stop initiating contact and see what happens. If they care about you, they will make an effort to reach out to you. Step 3. Make sure you are not being needy or clingy. During the no contact period, it's important to make sure you are not being needy or clingy. This is a powerful way when someone ignores you. For example, when they realize that you have stopped initiating contact, they might reach out to you. If they do, make sure not to reply right away. I know that when we get a text message or a call from someone we miss or care about, it's hard to control the urge to reply right away and tell them how much we miss them. But the key here is to take your time. Don't reply right away, even if you are tempted to. This will show them that you are not desperate for their attention and that you have a life outside of them. There is a psychological explanation for this behavior. When we ignore someone or don't give them the attention they want, it triggers what's called the scarcity principle. The scarcity principle is a psychological phenomenon that occurs when we feel like we are losing something or someone. This feeling of loss then makes us value that thing even more. Step 4. Keep yourself busy. By focusing on your own life and activities, you can take the power away from the person who is ignoring you. Instead of spending your time and energy worrying about why they are ignoring you, you can focus on enjoying your own life. Additionally, Keeping yourself busy can help to prevent you from dwelling on the situation and feeling even worse. This is the perfect time to work on your hobbies, goals and dreams, or to spend more time with your friends and family. Not only will this make you feel better, but it will also give you a sense of accomplishment. And when the person who is ignoring you sees how happy and content you are without them, it might make them realize what they are missing out on. Step 5. Be open to meeting other people. While you should focus on your own life, that doesn't mean you should shut yourself off from meeting other people. In fact, this is the perfect opportunity to meet new people and expand your social circle. You never know, you might meet someone who is even better than the person who is ignoring you. And even if you don't, meeting new people can help to take your mind off the situation and make you feel good about yourself. Again, this behavior goes back to the scarcity principle. 
When we feel like we are losing someone or something, we value it more. When the person who is ignoring you sees that you are meeting other people and having a good time without them, it will trigger that feeling of loss. And in some cases, this might be enough to make them come back to you and value you more than before. Step 6. Be ready to have an honest conversation. If you have followed all of the steps above and the person who is ignoring you still hasn't reached out to you, then it might be time to have an honest conversation with them. This is not always easy, but it's important to communicate your feelings and find out what's going on. When you're ready to talk to them, make sure to do it in a calm and respectful manner. Avoid getting angry or accusing them of anything. This will only make the situation worse. Here is how to do it in three simple steps. Step 1. Express your feelings in a non-accusatory way. For example, you could say something like, I noticed you have been distant lately. Is everything okay? Step 2. Listen to what they have to say without interrupting them. Step 3. If they don't want to talk or they don't give you a satisfactory answer, then you can calmly say something like, I am here if you ever want to talk. The key is to show them that you are not going to force them to talk if they are not ready, but that you are still there for them if they need you. Often times, just having this conversation can be enough to resolve the issue. But if not, then at least you will have clarity on what's going on and you can move on with your life. Step 7. Be willing to walk away. But it's also one of the most important. If you have followed all of the steps and the person who is ignoring you still hasn't changed their behavior, then you need to be willing to walk away. This doesn't mean you have to completely cut them out of your life, but it does mean that you need to distance yourself from them. This might mean unfriending or unfollowing them on social media, or it might mean not spending time with them in person. The key is to do what's best for you. And sometimes that means walking away from someone who is not treating you the way you deserve to be treated. Step 8. Create your own happiness. No matter what happens, it's important to remember that you are in control of your own happiness. This is a great way to deal with people when someone ignores you. You can't rely on someone else to make you happy. That's something you have to do it for yourself. Just because someone is ignoring you doesn't mean you have to let it ruin your life. Focus on the things that make you happy and don't let what other people do or say affect you in a negative way. If someone is ignoring you, it's their loss because they are missing out on being with an amazing person and eventually they will realize that. But in the meantime, just remember that you don't need them in your life to be happy. You can do it all on your own. Final thoughts. Now, you know what to do when someone ignores you. The purpose of this video is not to play the victim or to play mind games. Neither it is to manipulate the person who is ignoring you. You have to keep in mind that people are different and depending on the type of relationship and the circumstances, there are different things you can do. The key is to be aware of what's going on and to take action accordingly. Do not take everything personally and do not try to control the situation. The best thing you can do is to focus on yourself, work on your own happiness and be ready to move on if necessary. The right person will never ignore you. They will always make an effort to include you in their life.